So let's check our truth table for this statement. In this case, we're going to encounter and. So last video we talked about or or disjunction. This time we're going to talk about conjunction, something happening simultaneously. So four is an odd number and seven is an odd number. How are we going to find the truth value? So in this case, we don't really have to work hard. All we do we just represent that piece into a letter P or Q doesn't matter whatever, and this piece into uh, represent into a letter. And if we see the validity is it true or false we can just come out directly with true or false this come out directly and then we get our truth value so i'll just let introduce something here so we say let phi or q so phi we say four is an odd number that's simple is like that and q we say seven is an odd well question is what is the validity of those so if i look into the validity of those in this case i would like to say four is a odd number four is an odd number so that is false four can never be an odd number seven is an odd number so that is true now question is what is given let me rewrite the sentence here so the sentence here is four is an odd number i have a false so let's put down the false or what for this guy here and for this guy here i have true in the middle here and this guy i have and intersection and this is a true so i don't have to actually write down that stress i don't have to stress it all the way like that so what does it mean false or and true so false and true mm. so seems like we are looking into a conjunction so if you look into conjunction that means both simultaneously must work so if one of them falls the statement must be false so the truth value for this one is directly is going to be false take a look if we recall our truth value to the right side here so this is the conjunction so in this case well false and true so false and true which is false so this here false and true that's basically this guy here so that's the final answer down here it's coming up right from there 